Well, good morning everybody and welcome to our first YouTube of the term, Term 1, 2016. And I've brought with me today some of my fantastic New Year 7s and my head girl, my deputy head girl, and we're really going to talk to you about reading and how important reading is. Before we do that though, I do need to remind you of a few key dates. So, on Friday the 23rd, we will have a small open morning for those parents that couldn't make the open evening last year. On Monday the 10th and October the 11th, really important for our students, it's curriculum enrichment days when we can have lots of exciting things that happen off timetable. And on Monday the 17th of October, it's fantastic because it's our awards evening, it's where we get to celebrate lots of fantastic achievements from last year. So a huge congratulations and we hope as many of our students can come and collect the awards as possible. And then finally, very exciting day, on October the 18th is the end of term. So that means that's our first term completed for our New Year 7s at primary, which is fantastic. So today we promise we talk about reading. So first of all, what I wanted to talk to everybody about was our reading books that we're using for our exams. These are the Year 11 texts, and we have got Charles Dickens, A Christmas Carol. We've got Willie Russell, Lead Brothers. We have got um, Susan Hill's The Woman in Black, Victorian Horror Story. And of course, we've got the classic Romeo and Juliet, which you all know a little bit about. And as a leadership team, we've all agreed we're going to read these so we can have learning conversations with our Year 11s about these books. It's also doubly important because we have to learn quotes this year for the exams. So we will be doing that with our Year 11s to support them. So let's hear from our Year 7s. They're going to introduce themselves and talk about their favourite books. My name is Sophie and my favourite book is Hetty Feather by Jacqueline Wilson because it's very exciting and you never know what's going to be next in it. My name is Cameron and my favourite book is Skull because it jumps from one chapter to the other and it's hard to keep track of what's happening. My name is Jess and my favourite book is Kathy Cole Kiss at Midnight because it's like a teenage romance. My name's Nathan and my favourite book is The World's Worst Children by David Williams because it just makes me laugh like and any other book wouldn't make me laugh as hard as this one does. Great. And I'm told that you read every night at home, is that right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So we're going to talk a little bit about why that's important that we do that because when you come up from primary school, you're very good at this and I think sometimes it's fair to say at school we sometimes lose our way with this little bit so we're going to try and work on that this year so that's really important i'm going to introduce my head girl robin who's going to talk about her favorite book and my deputy head girl chloe my name's robin and my favorite book is shelter by harding coven it's a young adult book and it's a combination between a mystery and a thriller and throughout it it's full of suspense and lots of twists and turns my name's Chloe and my favourite book is 48 Hours to Die. It, I've got it on my iPhone, so and iBooks. Um, it's really good. It's about a serial killer, um, definitely a young adult book. Yeah. And I think it's important that we read lots of short stories, poetry, the newspaper. Do we read your newspaper every day? Yeah. yeah. Fantastic. Great. And we haven't left parents and carers out because we will produce and send home over the course of the next week or so our parents and carers A to Z handbook for this year which has got all the facts and things that you need about priory that are happening this year. So I think we have one final message about reading to leave everybody with. The more you read the cleverer you get. Nice simple message, the more that you read the cleverer you get. Thank you.